Jacob, the fans are uh, very happy to see you here coming up at the very end of this game. It was meant to be that try at the end, wasn't it? Um, kind of felt like it a wee bit, but uh, no, it's just, it was super to be back out there. It was a really long year, and uh, I think fair play to Gilly, first pass of his career, like, which is obviously exciting to see. So uh, it, was, uh, it was really, really good to be back out there. Some great moments out there, some, some good touches, and you got ball in hand early, I suppose it helped. Yeah, I think that's probably a, a bit of frustration from sitting in the gym watching player watching lads play. But uh, yeah, like it's obviously it was a good like it was a good fixture. I thought like Exeter were really physical, and think that's what we as a team needed. And me personally, I think I really needed that. You know, you've waited a long time to get your chance. How was it waiting that first half? You know, even to get the chance out there in the second. Do you know what? Actually, it was a really nice way to do it. You know, just like knowing that I had 40 minutes to kind of prepare myself mentally and, and relax a wee bit. You know. Just be back in the environment for half an hour before I had to, and um, so yeah, it was it was just it was a great way to do it, and I'm really really glad to be back back on pitch. I'm fair to say you've had a lot to deal with uh, over the last year, married, become a dad, and obviously the injury as well. So much to contend with. Yeah, exactly. Like I mean, the last time I was on the pitch, uh, I was just married. Now we have a baby. Uh, she's actually Hannah Broad tonight as well. So I don't doubt if she knows what's going on after four weeks, but. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's really exciting and it's, it's given me a, like, a new perspective on life, definitely. Yeah, how much is possible for you this year? Is it uh, stay calm one thing at a time at this point? Yeah, definitely. Like, uh, for tonight, it was get through injury free and I did that. So, um, you know, looking forward again, it's just it's the old cliche taking every game as it comes. But that is very much the, the scenario here. Like, you know, I'm not getting ahead of myself because I just can't afford to, you know. And the joys of pre-season, a few more running today. Yeah, here? I think so. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to try and say hello to my family really quick before. OK, go, them, go and see the baby, then get back into the runner. Good man. Well, there is one very happy man to be back, and I'm sure his family who have uh, been there with him every step of the, the way, and his, uh, his new baby as, as well, first match that he's uh, that's seen, seen the dad in, in action there. I mean, lovely pictures, uh, and nice for Jacob Stockdale to be back. Yeah, oh, it's fantastic to see him back on the pitch. Um, he actually he played amazing, yeah. like, for not having played in the past year. He was so good under the high ball and to see him break tackles and then and then get that try at the end, it was just, it was like it was written for him. Um, so no, it's great to see him back on the pitch. And rehabilitation from an injury family is very, very important, Rory. It is, yeah. I would suspect you spend a little bit more time with his daughter now because he's <laughs> getting out of the running, but it is. You need support around you and what you find is when you're playing and for Jacob when he's playing well and scoring tries, everyone wants a bit of you and all of a sudden you get an injury and especially a long-term one, and it feels very, very lonely. So it's that family, that support network, that'll get, get you through it. And yes, he'll go on now, hopefully kick on, score more tries, but that family will always be there for him. And that, that's a lovely moment at the end of the game. Yeah.